Good health. You know that, everyone, Jack. Oh, yeah, right, right. So, uh, what have you two been up to since we saw you last? Oh, not a lot. Budgie died. What? The Budgie died a few weeks ago. Oh, no. Shame. Getting on a bit, was it? No, no, it was quite a young Budgie, really. Forty-eight, it was. That's really quite old for a Budgie, Dad. <laughs> Uh, 48 in human years. You have to multiply each budgie year by, uh, what was it now? I uh, can't remember now. Five was it, or was it eight? I thought that was cats. How did it die? Maureen trod on it. <laughs> I did not. It flew onto my foot. I was cleaning out the cage with the vacuum cleaner. I always said Ted put that cage too high. I like to let him have a foot around once a week, you see. Who, Ted? No, no, Samson. <laughs> That's the budgie we called it Samson after her mother. <laughs> Shut up, Ted. Anyway, I was reaching up on my toes to hoover round the back of the stand, and when I came down on my heels, I heard a crunch. <laughs> oh, no. It's not that funny, Mary. I told you she was in a funny mood. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just the thought. <laughs> Did you bury it, Maureen? No, that's the thing that upset me most of all. I bent down to have a closer look and it sucked straight up the hoover. Ah! <laughs> Mary! Oh. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, it's all right, I suppose. If you don't have pets yourself, you don't understand these things. But to be perfectly honest, I didn't think much of a thing myself. <laughs>